Well, as you can see, I'm not in the woods anymore. Um, I didn't really want to talk in the woods. Risk spooking the deer. That little buck was... I mean, he's around. He's, he's close. I don't think he goes very far. So, very successful day, in my opinion. Uh, put in a little bit of work. Didn't start putting out corn until August. Um, and it worked out good. Um, I've been checking the trail cams. We had the little buck come in. I think it was a six point. Now, don't get me wrong. If it were December, and we didn't have so many prospects, there have been times in my life where I would have shot every arrow in my quiver at that deer and it hadn't been that long ago i'm just gonna be honest with you um but this early in the game with the prospect deer that we have here uh, if you haven't seen my video of me checking the trail cams um i'll put a card up check that out uh, and you'll see what i'm talking about so the the hard part about i guess hunting in general is um knowing if there's a big deer there if there is a big deer there, the worst thing you can do is to go in and hunt like you're hunting for does. Um, and there's a big difference in going deer hunting and hunting. Um, but we'll get into that at a later time. Um, I just want to say it was a good day. You know, just because you don't kill a deer doesn't mean it's not a successful day. Uh, there was some work that went into that. Got the feeder, got the corn, consistently checking the cameras and see what happens. Hopefully the bucks will come in. If not, you know, maybe, hopefully something will come in. Um, I remember years ago, if I saw a deer and I didn't shoot it, I felt like I, I had, I failed. Um, very good day, opening day, bow season. We saw a buck, he left, he came back, gave us a second shot at about seven yards. Um, definitely not gonna take it this early in the game. Um, but, you know, things change, and I'm not saying I wouldn't take that deer. Like I said, if it was December, and times were tough. I didn't have anything in the freezer. His ass would be grass. That's just the way it is. Um, but as of now, I held on it. It's not every day that you go hunting and actually even see deer. So, anytime you go and see deer, great day. Sometimes it's great just to get out no matter what. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have not subscribed already, please go ahead and do so. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss my next videos. It is deer season here in Georgia, and I'm going to be out there every chance to get. Um, I do have doe fever. I'm going to go ahead and tell you. But my plan is to not take a doe here until um, week after next. Today's Saturday. So this whole upcoming week, I'm <clears throat> not going for does. But if the bucks vanish off my camera the very next week, their lives are in danger straight up um, if I get if the bucks come in at any point during the next seven eight nine days then we're still on a holding pattern uh, we're not gonna we're not gonna ruin our chances to kill or I'm not gonna ruin my chances to kill one of those bucks on a doe so that's it thanks for watching see you on the next one